This is Cassandra Negley with Yahoo Sports, and we're looking at more upsets in the NCAA Women's Tournament. Shout out to the 20% of Yahoo Sports bracket users who picked Florida Gulf Coast to advance. That's a team that we were high on. We like that they're experienced. They're a great shooting team. They lead the nation in three-point rate. Now, they took down number five, Washington State, in the Greenville 2 region. We weren't super high on Washington State because they had flown through their Pac-12 tournament and were very hot, but they had a cooling off because we didn't play for a week and they might have been a little over seated whereas fgcu was under seated florida gulf coast actually got it done inside the arc instead of outside of it they hit only five threes that's tied for the fewest this season for them florida gulf coast now advances to play national player of the year maddie segris and villanova in the next round that could be an interesting game. Never count out the Eagles. The bigger upset of the day, though, was Toledo. Only 15.89% of Yahoo Sports Bracket users picked them to win over Iowa State. It was their first tourney win since 1996, and it is only their fourth all time. Now, these two teams actually lined up really nicely on paper. The Rockets outscored Iowa State by 10 in that second quarter and rode out the win. Four players were in double digits, and we really like that two of those players came off of the bench. Much like Florida Gulf Coast, this is a sharp shooting team. They hit it nearly 50% against Iowa State, and they had seven threes to win this game. Iowa State hit it only 35%, and they had six threes, but on 31 attempts, that's 20%. Ashley Jones ended her career at Iowa State with 23 points, 13 rebounds, an absolutely incredible career and a great game there. But it's Toledo that is riding its 17-game winning streak into the next round. They will play Tennessee. The thing we really like about Toledo in this one is they do not turn it over a lot. Their 12.4 turnovers rank top 20 in the nation, and they don't foul a ton, but they can get to the line themselves. We also want to shout out Drake, which took Louisville and Haley Van Lith down to the wire, which we saw coming. Haley Van Lith was on an absolute mission to get the Cardinals to the next round. The other double-digit seeds advancing from day one are Princeton, Georgia, and Mississippi State. We'll see if any of them can get to the second weekend. For more from the tournament, stay here at Yahoo Sports.